It was the talk of social media today, a major boat parade for President Donald Trump, resulting in several boats underwater this afternoon in Travis County. That's according to the sheriff's office there. The parade kicked off around 1130 this morning on Lake Travis and lasted for hours. The night team's Jaffney Gray joins us in the studio now with the latest on this incident. Jaffney, it was originally reported that no one was hurt. That's right, guys. After seeing the video, it's actually shocking. No injuries were reported, let me tell you. In fact, the only distress calls that did come in was for the boats. Thousands of supporters of President Donald Trump flocked to the lake, whether they were getting in the water or not. Despite COVID-19 warnings for the Labor Day weekend, many said that they were just out there to have a good time. But here's where the problems started, with boats varying from a 60-foot yacht to 8-foot fishing boats going in the same direction at different speeds. Rough waters created a choppy path for those participating. The first boat in distress call came 20 minutes into the parade. That was the start of many more calls, with the last one coming in around 2 p.m. The organizer of the event says that she had no idea so many people would show up to celebrate the weekend while supporting President Trump's hopeful re-election. For me personally, um, this is about, I'm a mother, and this is about my child's future and, and what I want that to look like. And this is my way of also stepping up and saying that, yes, I'm going to vote, but I wanted to do more. And this was something that I could do. As of tonight, the sheriff's office said that they were still sorting out just how many boats went under. They say it is unclear how many calls came in, how many boats sank, and how many were towed. In the studio, Jaffney Gray, KSAT 12 News.